What's up, everybody? It's Cashflow Nexus, your favorite chart analyst, back again, giving you the latest and greatest updates on the financial market. And today we'll be looking at XRP. But before we look at XRP, if you are new to this channel, you like what you see in here and feel compelled to sub, hit the subscribe button and the bell for notifications for future content. So today I put this out 100 XRP giveaway. The question was, was Bible Challenge. What was the first thing that came from God? that was with him since the beginning we have a winner folks so here was the rules it was short-lived but i was i'm i was happy that someone got it because it shows me it shows me that people are actually picking up the bible and reading it and that's what i am trying to strive for to get people to do so winner is I don't know if I'm saying this name right. See, Swans, Swan Sons. I don't even know if I'm saying that. But I will be hitting you up in your inbox to let you know that you have won, my friend. So the answer was wisdom. Coming out of Proverbs 8, 22 through 38, 31. So the answer was, I, wisdom was with the Lord when he began his work. Long before he made anything else. Yes, so that was the answer. I'm glad that he got it. It's amazing that he got it. So congratulations to you. This was a tricky question. A lot of people gave good answers, but you know, a lot of people didn't give scripture to back it up. And if they did, they still got it wrong anyway. So congratulations to you. Looking at the market now, the market is red and it looks like, well, it's not really red. It, it's going up and down. It's like, you know, topping off right now but not too much is going on with the the market as you can see um i do want to ask you guys if you guys are interested in more giveaways in the future let me know in the comments below so i so you could so i could think of some questions or think of some things uh that will be you know that will that i could do in the future and also i will be doing a te a deeper teaching on the question that I uh, that I asked today, but I'm glad that somebody got it. So looking at the charts, so we are this these red lines represent uh, resistance right now. We are currently being held at resistance, and if we go to the four hour time frame, we'll I'll take a deeper look at it. But this is the area that we're stuck in right now at resistance at the cloud level. This reminds me of this zone back in here from this area, same thing. It looks like it's repeating this whole area right in here, as you could see. So when we were up that high, we made a 34% drop. And if we were to repeat that same thing, which is over here from where we're currently at, a 34% drop, that will take us to 16 cents, as you can see here. So I'm not saying that's gonna happen. It's just something to be very mindful about. As you can see on the four hour chart, we are showing signs of weakness already. Uh, price action is even telling us that price cannot is having a hard time pushing up higher. So let me go ahead and box this in. Box it here. There we go. I'll probably, yeah, let me extend this out. So right here. So as you can see, we made a hammer, uh, we have a spinning top, and now we have a uh, dragonfly doji. So, you know, it's actually that's not a dragonfly, that's a gravestone doji. So, and then a spinning top right here as well. So, it, signs of the market is showing that we want to move to the downside right now if, you know, if we cannot break above this box and break above this fractal level which is at our current resistance that we're at on the daily time frame so i am monitoring that very carefully and closely because this area seems to be uh, pretty strong and if you look at the you know the daily time frame we are still in the downtrend as you could see here 
I did say we had to get above this area, which we did, but we also have to break the cloud level. So we may come back down to lower prices very soon, shortly. Uh, what I do see also, and I'm watching this, the RCI is saying that it has been trending up, but it hasn't broken above the zero line yet, which is showing us that it's still weak, but you know, that's, you know, until we get above this, then I'll be very bullish, but we haven't done so. So that being said, uh, I don't see this going any higher right now until we get above here until it proves me wrong. Um, uh, I don't have much more to say. Congratulations to the winner again. Uh, I will be sending you your 100 XRP shortly. So I will be reaching out. And if you are new to this channel and you like what you saw in this video today, comment and subscribe in the comment section. And let me know your thoughts on the movement of XRP. God bless you guys and peace.